Welcome to the base with Abby and Wilson. Today we have DJ Kamjo. Karibu sana. Uh, thank you, Wilson. Yes, we are very happy to have you here. Why do you look so concerned? What's with the look on your face? <laughs> no, I'm easy. I'm easy. Is it because he told you he's going to ask you scary questions? He does that. No, I'm, pre I'm prepared for anything. Okay. Yes. So for, for any eventuality. <laughs> for any eventuality. <laughs> okay, so how did you start your career? Uh, I started uh, my career by a fluke or something. I used to rap initially, and then I had... You used to rap? Yes. You know that means you're going to... Freestyle. Right. You're going to... There's uh, going to yes, be yes, a... Yes, yes. Just uh, so you know. I, after the show, yes. after no, the no, words no. have during, gone up. I, during... Yes. <laughs> <laughs> uh -huh, you started by a fluke. Yes. So, and then uh, my, my pal who I used to rap with, he bought uh, an old turntable. And uh, as I used to rap, and then they used to mix, I got into interested in what they were doing. So I started also myself practicing uh, on my own there. And then slowly I got into now the whole thing. What kind of music do you do? I do different kinds of music. I'm comfortable doing a variety of music because I have diverse clients in terms of uh, I may be called for a, uh, a family fun day which has kids. I might go to the club and it's a mature club mm -hmm. with a mature crowd. So basically, I blend across different kinds of music. Okay. Did you have a rap name? <laughs> it was always come to. Oh, okay. <laughs> I thought it was going to be something cheesy. Like, okay. So are you a fan of Mary Jane? I see you have a, a caffeine over there. That would indicate that you enjoy... It's just fashion. Really? <laughs> yes. Really? Fashion? Uh, it, it has not are you telling the youth of today that drugs are fashionable? That's what you're saying. Uh, no, I'm not saying drugs. I'm not saying <laughs> drugs are fashionable. <laughs> that's a drug. So can I can that's I write drug. can I have a t-shirt written cocaine? Cocaine. <laughs> Woo! And then fashion, I tell guys yeah. it's just fashion. Yeah. <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> so you so you don't do weed? I don't do weed. And you've never done weed? I've never done weed. I don't believe you. <laughs> that smell on your face that even Wilson is laughing. Wilson doesn't believe you. Never, no, ever. No. Never, ever, ever. Not that it's a good thing. Drugs are bad. <clears throat> but you're wearing her. I'm just saying. Or maybe it's for medication or something. Medical marijuana. That's no, legal I, in the I, States. I, have, I haven't gotten to such a point that I need <laughs> medical marijuana. <laughs> I'm just uh, affected by normal flu and malaria. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. But people take marijuana for that also. Trust. I like your shoes. Thank you. Did your girlfriend buy them? Or yes, she did. So there's a girlfriend? <laughs> yes, there is one. How long have you been together? Six years. Do you make mixtapes for her like those? No, she's just like, she gets like everything everyone else gets. No, like, you know, those, those romantic ones where you put specific, like your song, the first song you dance to, and then the song that you ask her <laughs> out to. You don't put those on a CD and you're like, it's romance in the 21st century, Ubana. You don't do that. So <laughs> no, it's, a, it's, it's a point to take over. Okay. <laughs> so six years down the line. Yes. Uh, any plans to wedding <coughs> put, a, put a ring on it. Yeah. Yes, so, they are. Yes, yeah? yes Soon? they are. Soon. Soon, uh, so the girlfriend should know as soon she's getting married. <laughs> <laughs> That's a confirmation on the show. Prepare. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah uh, yes. I just, yes. Why do you think um, Kenyans <laughs> break up so much? Like, why do you think the divorce rate in Kenya is so high? It's just, uh, uh, it's just society, a lot of elements, you know, we, we're trying to get into a level like where America is, so sometimes you end up picking up the bad habits. We are getting different expectations. Yes, yes, it's, it's, it's complicated. You can't like say it in one sentence. I think it would uh, warrant like another whole That's show it. to discuss <laughs> so why they're doing so. Okay. Something yes. about your career, like what specifically do you do? Like where do you DJ? And if I want to find you, where can I come to find you? Uh, in terms of uh, in terms of DJing, I'm a, I'm a mobile DJ, and uh, my main uh, my main forte is uh, corporate events and uh, private so events like weddings and things like those. So if anybody wants to get to me, there's a, there's a contact form on my website www.tchekamjo.com, mm -hmm. and then they can always just give me a mail and tell me what they want. But once in a while, I'll I'll I'll, I'll go to a club and. Just do a club set, you know, once a month, once in two months. But the bulk of my events is uh, private events. What weird things happen, like when you're DJing for like a random, like at a wedding, did a woman, did you catch the flowers or something? I don't know. <laughs> What's the weirdest thing that has happened when you're DJing? 
I can I can I can I can't name one uh, on top many? of my head. Oh, okay. Yes. Because if there were that many, that would have been a problem. Yeah. Okay. Uh, the name Kamjo. Were you given? Is it the name on your ID or where does mm. the name come yeah, from? Yeah, Kamjo is the name on his. I know. I normally <laughs> like it when it remains like a mystery. Uh huh. Yes. So you're not so gonna tell us? No, let's just keep it a mystery. Really? For yeah. real? So who gave you the name? I gave myself the name. And then you start telling guys. <laughs> Cam now call, you me, call, call me, call, call me, call me, call me Joseph this. Joseph Kamau. So what's your real name? What's your real name? Maybe it comes from your real name. What's this your real name? Just for another forum, an interview Joseph for Kamau. something formal. That's where it came from. That's where it came from. Okay. okay. What's the future for you, Kamjo? Uh, for me, I, I, I want to grow. I've established my niches, private events and corporates, product launches, uh, uh, things like end of year parties, uh, weddings. So for me, I, wa I, wa I want to grow my company into providing DJ services, being like the first provider for DJ services for that, uh, PA systems, lighting, and uh, other additional things like karaoke, backup generators for such events, and slowly grow to be able like to do full large scale events of up to like 5,000, 10,000 people in terms of sound. So I'm investing in, in quality equipment in related to that if in terms of speakers, microphones, lights, yes. Okay, are there people who are already doing that? Yes, there are, there, yes, there are people who are doing that. What's different with you? Uh, my, my, the difference with me is first of all how I do my events. There's, there's, there's the entertainment bit, but before even we get to the entertainment bit, there's the professionalism in terms of uh, punctuality, how we come into events, mm -hmm. how we engage the client to own the event so that you can get what you wanted or what you expected much more, and then also the quality of the service that you're getting. Okay. Okay. So, <coughs> like uh, you're saying, like your main niche is private, private, private parties and stuff. Yes. So, can you give us examples of top events that you've DJed? Like, uh, like last month, there was a there was a launch for Intel for Africa. The sof software they were launching something for software developers in Africa at Strathmore. So we provided uh, PA systems and uh, DJ services for for that. Uh, over and that, the companies like CFC Insurance, we've done uh, family fund is for them. We've done end of year parties for them. Uh, uh, last year, when Martini was doing. Uh, a relaunch for their bottle of the tribe. We did uh, lighting for them. P we did uh, also the PA and the DJ services for that particular event. And there are also several other companies we've worked with, uh, Glasgow Smith Klein, uh, we've worked with Nokia, we've worked with, uh, uh, who else, who else? Okay, let's okay. say several yeah. more people. Groupies and DJs. <laughs> <laughs> you've been a DJ for how long? You said how long? Uh, professionally, like the last uh, five years. The last five years. Yes. And you've dated your girlfriend for the last six years. Yes. Groupies and DJs. Yes. You know the story. So how have you handled that? Uh, I, I, I normally don't get a problem with groupies. Eh? Really? And yes. And the uh, thing is, people say I have this serious face when I'm... Yeah, it's the one you had at the beginning of the interview. <laughs> yeah, that yes. one. So I think that's like the ice break between me and groupies so they see the stone face and the legs yeah so <laughs> they just keep to the dance floor so it also maybe entertain them they just keep on the dance floor mm. yes. yeah. okay so mm. the rap session uh, the first song that you did mm. uh, yes. we need you to <laughs> do you need me <laughs> yes. please 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 do you need me it was i it got it you it was so many as well and uh yeah, yeah you always I think remember the lines you always right? remember the lines no i can't really i can't i can't i can't maybe 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 it's an incentive yeah, they work lines. it's a it's a it's an <laughs> incentive <laughs> down they were like. uh, no 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 hey, they were they were they were tight no no let me let me let me let me no no i, I won't rap but i'll prove how tight they were okay. eh? there's this day when i was in high school and uh we went to i think state house girls mm -hmm. and i was performing you know and i had like the whole uh, Groupies, is all, all girls, girls yeah, <laughs> screaming, yeah, you know. So and you can't really remember like the lines that you used. <laughs> and you can't I, remember the I, lines. I've chosen not to remember. You've chosen not yeah, to remember. Yeah, maybe when I come to the uh, base part uh, two. Yes. yes. 
So we'll invite you back specifically <laughs> to rap. for rap. Yes, for the battle. rap session. So please go and train. Okay. It's not bad. You can okay. go write some other new lines. Nini, nini. Yes. That's how. Yeah, okay. Okay, that was the base with DJ Kamjo. See you next week. <laughs>